Hey folks, this is Decoherent, and welcome back to The Arbillions. So we've got this place pretty well built up. Um, I've got all 5,000 population. I've got a bunch of days yet, 30 days, and I just need to build absolutely crap tons of defenses in that time. Um, I'm not really sure how I want to do that. Because I want a bunch of Thanatos, and I need just a ton of soldiers. So I could go ahead and I could start building a minimum of two soldier centers. I'm going to need I'm gonna need more than that. But I could start there. Where... Can I put them kind of diagonally across the colony from each other? Like one over here, maybe, and then one over here? It's not a great spot for it, but okay. And then we're going to need a bunch more power, and we will need more food. But we can deal with that a little bit later. So we're still getting 214 wood per turn. Um, if I could fit some more mills in, that would be nice. Is there any place good to put a mill? Yeah, sort of. I mean, I guess the question is, are there any good places to put them that aren't going to be in the way of the defenses or people trying to move around? The answer to that is no-ish. But, on the other hand, I still need that lumber. I can build power plants later. So, I have rather a lot of workers. Um, it's just food, really, that's going to be the thing. Um, I could put in another farm or so. Where could I put in a farm? Um... Here, maybe? This will actually be a fairly well-protected area back there. Yeah, I can't even put in a good farm. Be um, because of the forest. So, like, right here might actually be a good spot. 62, and then that'll double it when I upgrade it. Okay, that's that's fine. And then, yeah, like I said, we're just going to produce all the guys in the world. Where do you train from? Right here. Tons and tons and tons of Thanatos. Oh, you know what? I should actually go ahead and I should spend all of my money right now on building towers. Towers everywhere. Towers for days. I don't know where to put towers. I don't know. There's, there's, there's a few towers. I don't, I don't really know how to put towers. <laughs> I've never really figured out a good system for it. So, yeah. It's just like, uh, tower, why don't you go right there? I'm trying not to put them so far back that I won't be able to shoot easily at things with snipers. Okay, Soldier Center. All right, good news. You go there. And you go there. And now produce all the snipers in the world whenever you have money. Oh, there we go. Wow, that's rather a lot of money. Okay, looking good. And we'll need a bunch of Thanatos and then probably some Titans. And you guys... Where should I put you so I don't lose you? Um, how about you go... Problem with these big bases is I lose track of where all my guys are. Just come over, come over here. I can find you over there. Yeah, go over there. Yep. And then I will just go ahead and keep building towers. Okay, so there's some towers. Um, kind of around the outside. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. If I knew what I was doing, you probably wouldn't be watching this channel. So, now let's keep building, um, the shocking towers. I know we've discussed that they're probably not the right option for a lot of these places, but I'm putting them in anyway because I like them. Because they're really good against large swarms. Um, I know they'll promptly get knocked down by the big guys, but... Whatever we can do to help secure the border is good. Yeah, stone 30. Getting as much stone as I can. At least I can keep these cubes going basically forever, as far as I can tell. And yeah, and I want a lot of Thanatos because... same thing. Okay, I've now ringed my base here with uh, these amazing shocking towers, which I love to death. I don't care if they're any good or not. Um, and let's go ahead and let's put some executors in too while I'm at it. Can't go wrong with uh, mechanical defenses, that's what I always say. Well, I said it once. We'll build as much mechanical defenses as we can squeeze in, and then obviously fit in, you know... Oh, this doesn't fit. Oh, this isn't useful at all. Um, okay. Try that again. Oh, well, okay, that's fine. And then obviously we'll just fill in the gaps with snipers, and it looks like we'll need a couple there. So, okay. How about over here? Can I get some useful range? Actually, I can. Both directions, sort of. Well, I should probably actually talk about what's going on around here. Um, so I have built um 
a rather large army of snipers. Um, I have towers kind of everywhere. Um, if it looks like I didn't really know what I was doing, then that's probably pretty accurate. Um, I actually have more snipers than I know what to do with, which is kind of a strange place to be. Like here, there's three of you. One pair to this empty tower. Um, I have an awful lot of Thanatos around because I like them quite a bit. They're good for crowd control. Um, I still have four things or four soldier centers cranking out snipers as fast as they can, and I have no place to put them. So I'm just going to keep building towers everywhere, I guess, in the hopes that I won't need them, but then they'll be there. You know what I mean? Um, how does that go? Better to have and not need? Something like that? You know what I mean, anyway. But, um, yeah. I'm just running out of useful locations to put towers is the biggest problem. I can put them here and there, I guess. But, like I said, I'm trying to put them in useful places, which is a little different than just putting them anywhere. Oh, and I've been deploying a bunch of wasps. Not just the free ones, but, like, actually paying for some. I know they're not ideal, but I do like having that little extra bit of damage. I feel like sometimes that has, to, like, turned the tide. Or, the giants will come up and swipe them, and they will all promptly die. Any of these things could happen. One of them is more likely than the others. It's the one where all my things die. Um, I don't even want any soldiers. Just keep making snipers. And I think I'm good at Thanatos. I made a couple titans just because I upgraded them to lasers, and I want to see what that looks like. I mean, I can just have these guys standing around. They don't have to be in towers. It's more efficient if they're in towers. Oh. Alright. Well, that was a little quicker than I expected. Oh god, it is day 71, isn't it? Um, okay. Well, I have a few more Thanatos I should have deployed, um, but obviously didn't. Um, hey, luckily for you guys, there's a tower right there. It uh, probably doesn't really matter where they go. Let's actually put you guys over... Kind of by the entrances. Because seriously, like, those are the weakest parts of my fortifications, of course. Because they're gates. Um, it's never really been a problem before. But it may suddenly become a problem. And I feel like there's an area up here I wasn't comfortable with either. Actually, I'm not really comfortable with any of that. So just, just, just fill it up. Here's another tower that I apparently built and have not had time to build, uh, fill yet. I mean, I'm doing my best, but we're out of time now, so, I mean, this is, this is kind of it. Um, come over here. Oh, I never finished putting in my, uh, barbed wire, did I? Well, luckily, I can go ahead and do that now. There we go. Does it help? Uh, like I said, every time this comes up, I wonder, should I waste all my iron and gold in this? And then I do it anyway. So, oh well. I don't have time to train up anything, so it's like... I may as well just do that. Um, let's buy a bunch of iron. Because the gold will tick faster. Wow, this was ticking at like 6,000 at its peak. Wow. How the tides have turned. Okay, do I have any of these empty towers still standing around? Or should I just deploy these guys kind of on the ground? Um, there's a tower over here. But only one of you nearby. There's two more of you. Here, come join that tower. Um, there's an empty tower up there. There's no way I'm gonna get that filled in time So hopefully the towers that are filled are the important ones Is there any way you guys can get up here? Maybe Just give it a try No, not you uh, You stay down here All right, well here we go. This is it God, I hope I didn't screw this up Oh yeah, my rangers. I forgot about them. Oh shoot, and I've got structures out here that I'm going to destroy. Um, if I can. Just because I don't want them turning into more zombies. Do I have time out here? Just barely. No free zombies for you. I'm gonna have enough problems on my hands. Yeah, and I can see the fast ones running at me. Luckily, none of these were essential to any of my actual operations. These were just like... These were considered expendable from the very beginning. Okay, looks like that's it. Alright, well, here we go. 
And I have all of you set to the highest level, right? Yep. Hmm. Well. Here we go. I wish I had some uh, snipers in there, to be honest. Actually, can I just transfer you guys over to here? No, actually, you're fine where you are. Alright, well, let's keep an eye on what's going on. This area is pretty bad. But, it looks like things are under control. Things are fine over here. It looks like things are doing alright up there. Not as good down here as I would prefer. Can you come over a little bit? Like, the train doesn't come during these, right? I wonder what they're getting stuck on. Yeah, they are. That is kind of their thing. I'm not going to lie to you. Okay. Well, this is good so far. I mean, no giants or anything. I mean, I'm sure they're going to show up. Oh, I haven't even gotten my titans in. Where are my titans? Um, come up here, maybe? I want to see if you have lasers. Of course our defenses are being attacked. That's the whole point. Here, come over here. Maybe someone will get close enough that you can use your lasers. Oh, they look the same. Oh. Well, alright. Come over here then. This place needs the help. Getting uh, quite a bit of veterancy, aren't we? Up here is not as happy as I would like. That's one of the few places that I'm actually getting like damage to my defenses. Um, not you, but you five snipers standing around. Why don't you come up here? I know you're really not going to be super effective standing on the ground. I guess I could just keep clonking repair as hard as I can. Hey, what's going on here? You seem kind of getting stuck there. Huh. Oh, this. This shouldn't be out there anymore. Ah, and there's one here too. This is looking fine. This is no big deal. I mean, we're not even taking any significant damage. I mean, okay, I've had a long time to prepare, mind you. But even so... I'm just waiting for, like, the giants to show up, is what I'm waiting for. To, like, end my colony, because I'm not totally sure I can keep them out of my walls. Hey, you're not getting any worked in over here. Why don't you come over here? There we go. Now you can actually get some work done. I mean, if anything besides that one person shows up. Well, I got a, got a lot of veteran snipers that time, so that was pretty cool. Oh, that was it! Well... How about that? Good for me. Just kind of flailing my way through that. I'm proud of that. Of course that's never the end. The Goddess of Destiny. Oh my. 24,760. Colonists. Fresh. Fresh. Executives. Harpies. Venoms and infected mutants. Won't that be fun? Okay. Maybe I should do this first because these do give me some empire points, but that's like one unit. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and let's take a break. When we come back, I guess we're going to throw ourselves headlong into this infected swarm and then maybe start the Goddess of Destiny. So, as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.